warrior. No, don't throw it away. Bread warrior. Bread warrior. No! Welcome back to The Sims 4 Memes Theme! And today is an exciting day because today we are finally going to open Oprah's Bakery. All right, Oprah, let's buy a store. Oh my God, look at the family down here. Also, way to block Earth Chan completely, Savage Patrick. Completely blocked her. Oh, and what's this beautiful looking place down here with the giant loaf of bread on top? Oprah's Bakery, how convenient. We will buy it. Oh my God, it looks so cute. Get ready for the speed build. It's coming. The speed build is coming right now. Well, now that you have seen all the time and effort and energy I put into this place, look at it. Look how beautiful. All right, so there was some stuff that was left by the creator of the original building, which was R-R-G-S-A. So that was the original building, and then I just made it more browns because to Oprah only likes the colors of bread. But the original bakery had all of this stuff already here and made. And then I just added in some more bread. And, uh, I guess we gotta set up our business. We need an employee. Oh my god. We can hire Laurel Yanny. Yes. Perfect. Employee uniforms. Ooh. This will be my employee uniform. Because they are bread warriors. All right, and now we need to price things. Set for sale. Set for sale. But you know what? The only way Oprah's gonna give up her bread is if it's a 100% price markup. She's not giving away her bread for free. Now let's open. All right, where is my bread gladiators? Laurel! I mean, yammy Laurel! Ugh. This is not the correct uniform. Does that, what? I just did this. What is this? There we go. My bread gladiator. I look super shifty. I'm like, don't you dare buy any of this bread. This is all for me, okay? Oh, look, we're bringing in the rich crowd because we have 100% markup. Don't you dare buy any bread. This is all my bread. This shop is just a front so that I can eat all of the product and nobody can question me. Does anybody actually want to buy stuff for 100% markup? I better start eating the product before it goes bad, so. Nope, nobody wants to buy any of my bread. Well, good, you guys aren't worthy. Bread Gladiator, make sure nobody steals or eats the bread without paying. Or just period. Just don't, don't, don't let anybody eat or buy any of the bread. Nobody wants to buy anything because of the price markup. And Oprah is just eating all of the product. Perfect. This is exactly what she wanted. This is why she opened this place. Keep going, Bread Gladiator. Nobody wants to buy anything. Let's greet the customers. Come on, Oprah. Greet them. She's like, I'm gonna sit and eat while I greet people. Hello, welcome to Oprah's Bread Bakery. This girl is like, I would like some bread, but I can't pay a thousand dollars for a slice of bread. Oprah's like, well, then you don't deserve the bread. <laughs> and she's like, oh, close the deal. Ask about price range. Well, what kind of price range are you looking at for bread? I only serve the finest bread. What choice? What value? I'm ready to buy. When you get a chance to ring me up, what? Hmm, should we sell her bread? Should we sell her bread? Are you worthy? I mean, she's the only one willing to pay the price for bread. She is now going to be Oprah's best friend. Oprah, come come ring her out. She's like, you are worthy for bread. You're going to pay me a thousand dollars, right? I also like your hair, girl. It's like fire. She has purchased the bread for twelve hundred dollars. Yes, yes, you are worthy of the bread then. I probably made my day's worth of bakery sales in one sale. <laughs> oh, this guy's ready too! You are worthy. Only people who can pay my high prices are worthy. She's like, so that will be, um, a thousand something dollars. And then I'm gonna use that money to buy more bread. Yes. Twelve hundred dollars for some crescent rolls or croissant rolls, however you want to say it. Let's restock the bread. And then let's continue eating product. Fancy lady, you've been in here a long time and have not bought anything. Ask customer to leave. Oh my god, he just farted. Ask customer to leave. Do not fart around my precious bread. Oh, somebody else wants to buy stuff. Where are you? Wait, 
Somebody wanted to buy stuff. Oh, she's finally worthy. Bring up customer. Oh, and this guy. Bring up customer. Oh, no, they're getting impatient. I mean, if you can't wait for the bread, then you're not worthy of the bread. Bread gladiator. Bring up customers. We got three of them. If they don't wait to purchase the bread, then they were not worthy of the bread. So don't worry about them. Like her. You are not worthy. Get out of here. Get get out of here. Get out of here. Get your non-worthy bread butt out of here. Yeah, that's right. More bread for me. Oprah. Is she ringing up people? Bread gladiator, are you ringing up people? Yes, okay, good. I will continue eating product, which is my job. Yes, another $1,200. Keep selling, bread gladiator. I will continue to eat the product before it goes bad. <gasps> what? You? I Didn't I ask you to leave? She didn't pay for this. She did not pay for this cake. Okay, well, first of all, I'm gonna steal your money now to make up for the cake stealing. Get it, Oprah. Get it. No, not the cake or the bread. I mean, you can get that first. She's like, oh, gotta fuel up. Fuel up with my bread first. Then I'm gonna go steal this tramp's money. Oh, yeah. Go, go get it. Get it, Oprah. Get, get, get that money. Uh. <gasps> How dare you? How dare you steal bread from Oprah and then yell? At Oprah, do you not know who I am? Girl, get ready to find out who I am. Give me back the cake! Give me back my bread! Give it back to me! Cough it up, I'm gonna eat it! Cough it up! Cough it up! You guys don't get it, she stole from me! She stole bread from me! Don't be ashamed, Oprah! Get her out of here! Yeah, that's right, never come back again! And now, I'm going to eat the remainder of her cake. That's just what I, Bread Obsessed Oprah, does. I'm like, yes, yes, look at, look at me eat this cake in front of all of you guys. You peasants that can't afford my bread prices. You look at this, look how good it smells, yes. Oh yeah, that's right. I can eat all the bread I want. You guys can't afford it, and I'm just gonna eat it in front of you. Everybody's just staring, they're like, it's way too expensive. A cupcake is like $700. Oh, we've been open for nine hours, I should probably close. Let's close. Wow, we made a profit and I only sold like three things. Oh yeah, who's the best? Who's the best bakery owner ever? Oprah, she's the only one that can sell cupcakes for $700 and baskets of bread for $1,200. Oh yeah, Oprah, I knew you could do it. I had faith in you, girl. All right, now let's clean up. Oh no, everything went bad. Can I still eat it? Take a piece, I don't care. We're gonna eat moldy, smelly bread right now because that is our life. That's why I was trying to eat it. She's like, I don't care. It's still bread, it's still delicious. I will eat it. I will go- Oh, just crumble. <laughs> Suck it up. It's still delicious. Just eat, eat all of it. All of it. Keep eating all of it, Oprah. I don't care if you get sick. It's worth it. I literally have her eating all the bread. I mean, I knew having this bakery would be dangerous for Oprah. She wouldn't be able to handle herself. I knew it, but it's okay. This is her life now. Eating moldy, smelly cake. Keep, keep eating. Keep eating all of it. We can't let it go to waste. I wonder if she could eat all of this. I mean, I don't think you could die in The Sims if you eat too much. La 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 da 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 Keep eating the gross cake. She's literally eating all of it. It's somewhat making me feel nauseous that she's eating cartoon foods that have like green stank coming from them. I don't know why it's making me feel nauseous. It's all fake. I guess I'm just not that dedicated of a, of a bread lover like Oprah. I think we need to replace all this real food with this uh, fake bread food so it doesn't spoil. She's still eating it. Keep eating it. Oh my god, she finished the one. No, did it all go bad? Oh no! It all went bad! Oprah, you- Oprah, Oprah, you're gonna have to eat it all. Gonna have to eat it all. Okay, well this one's done. Oprah, I'm sorry. <laughs> can we stick it in the fridge for later? We can't put it in the fridge, but we can put it in our inventory. There we go. There we go. Put all the spoiled products right in here. There we go. Okay, I think that's it. Alright, let's put some more new stuff out to buy. More bread. Go. All right, I think we're good. Let's open again. Ooh, I can get a trophy. Yes, let's display it for everybody. Wait, where is it? Oh, I can just buy it now? Better be free. I couldn't find it. That was all for nothing. All right, I think I set everything for sale. Oh my God, tell me this girl is back in this store. Girl, <laughs> did I not teach you to stay away from here? All right, Oprah, while you're sitting around, you might as well just finish your spoiled food. <gasps> Bread warrior! No, don't throw it away! Bread warrior! Bread warrior! No! Bread warrior, you have betrayed me. You have betrayed me. Also, dude, what are you doing? This is the staff room. Get out of here. Lock door for every- What? Nope. Dude, get out. Ask customer to leave. 
So get out of here. This is an employee area, sir. Everyone but employees. Girl, I told you not to come in here ever again. Yeah, that's right. Out of here. Ooh, ooh, I knocked her out. Oh, Oprah knocked her out. Oh, that's right, girl. Whoa. Whoa, that was weird. Get out of here. She's still asleep, apparently. Are you sleepwalking? She's sleepwalking. Whoa. Okay, good. She's out of here. She's out of here. Sorry you guys had to see that. I'm sorry. Would it make you guys all feel better if I gave you guys all of my money? Yes. Yes, here's all of my money. All of Oprah's money. You get money. And you get money. Everybody gets money. You guys all forgive me now, right? I just get really worked up when, you know, people try to steal my bread without paying, as would any shop owner. Okay, now use that money to pay me for my bread. And I will continue to eat my spoiled bread. Oh, look at that. I got a little pat of butter with this one. Oh, yeah. It's still spoiled. But it looks delicious. Look at the mold. Look at the mold on that. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh no, it's delicious. You don't know what you're talking about. Anybody want to buy anything? Oh, she does. Bread warrior. You need to do stuff. Oh, never mind. It took too long. You are not worthy anyway. Goodbye. If you can't wait for me, then you're not worthy of the bread. Oh, my God. She's- <laughs> That's it. That's right, girl. That's right. You made me do this. You made me- Look at Oprah's face. She's like, oh, girl, you gonna die. You gonna die, girl. You gonna die. I'm gonna kill you, girl. I'm gonna kill you. Get out of here. I don't know how many times I have to tell you to get out of here. No, no, guys. This is okay. Don't worry. I'll give you more money. I'll give you more money, all right? It's just Oprah. It's just Oprah. I can't do anything wrong. Good. She's finally gone forever. All right. Don't worry. Hold on. I'm gonna give you- Crap. I can't give more money. Uh, yes, bread warrior. Yes, bread warrior. You are on my side. I love you, girl. I love you. Just wait a little bit. I'll be able to give you money. I'll be able to give you money and we'll all forget about this. Okay? Let that be a lesson. Don't ever steal my bread without paying or asking. Thank you. Oh, bye. You don't deserve my bread. You don't deserve my bread anyway if you're running away scared. This is another test. If you guys are not scared after this to buy my bread, then you are worthy. You are worthy of my bread. And this is my trophy. I, I will take my trophy. I'm gonna bake her ashes into bread. Yes. It's gonna be the best bread I've ever baked out of her ashes. I can't wait. Let's bake it right now. Baking some bread out of my enemy's ashes. Oprah's Bakery episode has taken a really dark turn. <laughs> but look, look how happy she is. We're gonna use her ashes in this bread recipe and then we're gonna sell it to everybody. Yeah. <laughs> there goes her ashes. Yes, and just poured them in. Nobody wants to buy any bread? No? Well, hold on. I got a special bread coming for everybody. Just to make you all like me again. Oh, look at that beautiful bread. Look, everybody, bread. And guess what? This one's not for sale because everybody can have a piece. But of course, me first. I'm gonna have a piece first. This is Oprah eating the ashes of her enemies. She's like, yeah, it's delicious. Come on, guys, don't you want some free bread? Oh, that guy got some bread. Yeah. How's that bread? Oh yeah, it smells delicious, doesn't it? It definitely wasn't made of human. Oh, she's- wait, no, bread warrior! No, 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 Ah, oh, apparently I overworked her. It's fine, I'll ring up the customers and then we'll call it a day. What if we still made a profit today? I mean, not counting the money that I had to throw into the air to make everybody forgive me. Close. We did make a net profit. Running a restaurant in The Sims is so much harder than a retail store, I'm telling you. All right, Oprah. It's time to go back to the house and see everybody. Let's take your uh, dead woman bread with you. I'm sure they would enjoy that. And let's go home. Just another day at Oprah's Bakery. Everybody, here's some bread made from the blood of my enemy. Also, why is Knuckles super dirty? What happened since I've been gone? Just like, everybody come try. Come on. She just grabbed a serving for herself. Nobody can get to it, really? There. There we go. Everybody eat. I must get rid of the evidence. <laughs> the murder evidence is gone. Fantastic. Thanks, everybody. I've never watched Savage Patrick eat. Does he actually stick it in where his mouth is? Oh, he does. Nice. Oh, look at Yodel Boy doing his own dishes. Oh, are you kidding me? Yodel Boy. Ugh. 
costing me money there. I love how Robot Sock is just sitting up here by himself. <laughs> what are you doing? Earth Chan and Savage Patrick are dancing together. That's cute. What else is going on? Tide Pod Chan's on the computer. Bullet Chan's on the computer. Clorox Chan is playing games. I don't know what these three are doing. <laughs> oh, you're stealing soda from Yodel Boy, huh? And then sitting on his bed. This looks kind of creepy. Gun and Knuckles wants to go on a walk. You Bullet Chan, take him on a walk. Come on. You know the deal. <laughs> She's like, I guess I'll put this glass of water down right here then. Go take him. Look what Zuck is watching. Zuck, are you still planning world domination? Is this, is this, you're trying to figure out how to do it? Wow, Oprah's still eating. Savage Patrick, what'd you do? He seemed really happy about it too. Stop making me spend money. Shia's dancing. Oh yeah, Shia. Yeah, break it down, Shia. All right, guys. Well, I think that's going to be it for this episode of The Sims 4 Memes Theme. Not sure what I feel like doing yet next episode, but if you have any ideas, suggestions, new characters, then let me know in the comments below for next episode. As always, if you made it this far in this episode, then make sure to leave a like before you go. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, or else Oprah will turn you into bread and eat you. I upload every single day. And as always, I will see you guys soon.